Hello all, Havoc here. All right, so we've had a small issue. Um, there was a base in front of us when we logged out at the end of the last episode. It no longer exists. So I'm at the point where I'm afraid to go back to our base Because everything I log out next to you is vanishing when I come back in. That's kind of disturbing. Well, it's not kind of disturbing. It's seriously disturbing. Uh, that's, I think, is our base right there. Um, I... This is new. That's two days, two bases in a row that uh, have both vanished. And I put a lot of effort into that base to just have it vanish like that is kind of not cool. I, that's, I'm, I'm really scared that that's going to end up being the case as we're going to come back, we're going to park. Log out and log back in, and then everything is gone. Get right over by our own rover. Okay, so it's not that one, it's that way. So that must be our base then. It's only 800 meters away. Yeah, I can see the rover. So that's our base right there. Uh, so, yeah, I wanted to loot that base, and it just wasn't there. It just straight up noped out. Like, there was nothing. Like, nothing underground. You can see we still have those little bits that we didn't take out below the terrain. Same with that one and that one. Yeah, everything is just gone. So if that's the case, um, I'm going to end up uh, taking some time off from stationers, it looks like. Um, I don't want to lose everything I've got, because that would be really frustrating. Why isn't our beacon showing up? Oh, there it goes. All right. It was showing up before when uh, we were driving the rover. Oh, see, now it is showing up. Okay. Because I know it doesn't show up in the Mark II rover because it has, like, polarized windows or something that causes it to where you don't get that beacon effect. Uh, so if any of you know why um, these bases are deleting themselves whoa, in the fashion they are, please comment down below uh, whatever I can do to stop from what is about to be a seriously terrifying experience. I honestly don't look at... Okay. What happened? Just tons of trash ore. This was not like this when we left. Um. I I honestly don't. I don't know. Kind of uh, at a loss for words here. Uh, it's 
putting that stuff back. So it's that's all fixed. That's all up to date and ready to go. Did all the voxel reset down here? I hope not. No. That's good. Well, that's really good. Except for there is a plethora of ores now. Holy cow. That is a lot of ores. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, that's a mess. Take us to the top, Bob. Never mind. We're just going to do that instead. Send it. All right. Um, yeah. We're home. This has been running forever. It's gained a whole eight degrees since we left. So we have to uh, get that update going. This place is a mess now. It's weird. You stepped on something. Made a Maybe it's some batteries making a weird noise. I'm hearing things. All right, so uh, do we have them on us? There's one. Yay! I think we got one more somewhere. We should have two more, which is kind of sad. Computer. Large transformer, suit storage, door. Okay, so obviously somewhere else. Yeah, uh, I didn't get the credit card. The, 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 yeah, there's shenanigans going on. Why do I have two storage cards? Oh, I was going to sell that one. That's why. I'm super bummed. All right. Uh, that one's probably charging that one. Yeah, that'll go up a pip here in a second. Oh, yeah, because I'm also doing it at night. Uh, that's fine. Those two, uh, everything should probably actually balance out. That's probably what's going to happen. They're all going to go down to probably two pips. Wait, input and output are on two different sides. How is that? Ball? No, no, they're not balancing. I don't know. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. It'll be fine. Because we have RTGs running up there, which we should also go and plug in our other RTGs. Just want to make sure this isn't going out of control. I just lost seven degrees, so yeah, I'm done with that. We're gonna have to try that uh, other method that HBD was talking about. Okay, what do you got? Stuff. You've got stuff. You got. More stuff.
transformer and more stuff. Okay. That's just straight up cash. All right, so there's an RTG to go place. What do you got? One RTG? I thought I had two. Oh, I have three, okay. So three RTGs and there's the battery, okay. Yay. Oh, and why didn't I use the GPS? Because I totally didn't even think about it until after I had left that area. Uh, comments in that last episode uh, was brought up. Why didn't I use a GPS? Put a GPS marker down instead of using the... Um... I went with basically a de angle of departure. Uh, I don't know how you would want to phrase that, but... Basically, I did not do what I should have done. Come on, right there. So what I should have done was uh, put our GPS tracker in and put a GPS marker down. But I didn't, because I'm a dork. Um, So that goes like so. And that goes like so. Better. Yeah, buddy. All right. So I can take that frame down, in theory, and move it over here. Move this one over here. As we get a few more batteries, we can start plugging them in. I don't have access here. My tent was. Well, I want in there. I'm going to go upstairs. Taking it to the top. So working as intended as we come up here. When we come down here to get to here. That's not plugged in yet. All right, so basically what the goal was is to line this area with RTGs. Really? You're gonna be like that? All right, fine. Put that back then. There we go. And then we take you and you. And we're producing one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten thousand kilowatts of power. I think they produce one point five each. I think. So that coupled with the sun just not coming up on the horizon, uh, those batteries will all be topped off like super fast. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and do this. Why are you erroring? I 
I have no idea why. I'm going to go out on a limb and say this is full. Not even. Okay. Ah. Uh, super frustrated in the fact that I'm going to do all of this and then log in tomorrow. And this is all going to be gone. Um, that's the case. Then uh, we're going to... Well, like I said, we're going to step away from Stationers for a minute because I'm going to load up back up basically from where we left off over there and when we did the drive here. And then we will uh, step away until hopefully they can patch this problem. I'm seriously at a loss of what I want to do right now. Hey, hey, get over here. I'm not better off doing this downstairs. Because I can just throw it into the... I can just do that. Alright, so that's going to go here. Close this guy. This guy here. You know what? All this is gone. I should recycle. No, I'm just going to get rid of it for now. These will keep. That will keep. That will keep. And that will keep. All right. You come here. Oh, no, you can't because that's a max stack. Why can't it be 30 with the rest of them? Hmm? Eek! No, I don't want those in there. Don't, those don't need... Oh, come on. There, better. <laughs> Lockers will keep these in here. Crate, container mount. Oh, that could have killed us. More lockers. We should be able to do all of the lockers now. That'll be nice. Suit storage, we already have one. Large transformer, don't need that either. Grenade! Um... We'll keep that for now. Electronic sprinter we don't need. Oh, too many Christmas. Throwing grenades, just, just there's just a few things wrong with that. I'm just <laughs> just saying. Uh let's get rid of you too. Uh, railings can go. Cryo tube. All right, so we're gonna throw this stuff in here. There we go. Let's go over here. And collect it all up. Uh, beacon. Actually, I'm going to leave that in there. Cryo tube, that can go. All right.
Some of these are just downright terrifying. Keep. Should be recycling these, but. Like I said, if we log in tomorrow, it's all gone, then it really doesn't matter. <laughs> I like how it takes a second. It's like, yeah, we'll go ahead and go in there. Just just because. I mean, we're, we're going to be nice about this. Oof. Just yeet that right in there. <laughs> all right. Uh, we're going to keep all of that. And that's good. All right. So we'll get down to... The spendy stuff. More grenades. Oh, come on. Getting that sweet spot of uh, where you can and cannot drop stuff. Okay, you're done. All right, so you, in there, you, in there, in there, and in there. Good? All right, <laughs> good. This is when we hear an explosion upstairs, and um, <laughs> thank you guys for watching. <laughs> Slap myself in the face with some plastic explosives. All right, and we'll keep the rest of this. So that's good. Wow, that was pretty quick. You heal, you heal. I'm still torn on that. That might be considered part of this kit. All right, so we get rid of the lights and railing. Actually, we're going to recycle the railing. Um, we need some of it to recycle. So we'll keep it for that. The lights, though, can go. All right, so let's get you over into here. I'll update that. You guys are sell. I sell this too. We have one right there. We don't need two of them. <laughs> Those things are so terrifying. All right, so that pretty much wraps up the stuff I want to sell. Car's empty. All the batteries are updated. Got one of these empty? Relatively empty? Yeah, there we go. All right. So, oh, wrong floor. My bad. Sorry. All right. So you, we're going to go ahead and do this. Temperature, no. Okay, and we're going to put this stuff in here. So uh, it's not inside the vending machine, so we don't accidentally sell all this really awesome ores. Okay. I don't 
remember how much is actually in here. I know it's a, it's a, a fair amount. Could that be it? Yeah, that's it. All right. I said I wasn't sure, but all right. So uh, traders, uh, screwdriver. Wrong way, I have it. Okay, great. Color Corp, nope. Hydraulic kit? Um, I'd rather hydraulic kit than uh, Color Corp. Oh, jeez, I'm doing that again. Okay, it looks like we're all maxed out there. There we go. Let's see what you got, buddy. All right, so uh, pipe organ, wall cooler, radiator, wall heater, uh, water bottle filler, portable gas tank, Mark II. Um, nothing really. He's got nine thousand dollars though. So how much does a microwave go for? Two hundred dollars. Wow. Okay. Down with that. Now, solid generators, another hundred dollars. These are twelve dollars a piece, so we're going to keep those for nickel and diming people, I think. So, remote detonators, Ooh, grenades are spicy expensive. Hundred twenty-nine dollars. So let's get down to six bucks. What do you got for six dollars? What do you want to buy for six bucks, buddy? Got a lot of sell. Alien mushrooms are cents. Pennies. Pennies, I say. Handguns are $2,600 a piece. All right. Um, oh, five bucks. Here we go. I think that's about the best we're going to do is uh, one basketball. Good for it. Thanks for visiting. How nice would it be that we could actually, like, I heard it, like, dispensing stuff left before the transaction was done. That'd be kind of funny. All right, so let's go ahead and go. Big hit there, 284. All right, so smaller hits. And that's it, 360 is max. Uh, that gets me every time. I'll put this up to about here. Okay. Anybody? Anybody? Wow. There's really nobody wanting to trade. Oh, there we go. Spec small, small business. We're going to call this guy in, and then we're going to take it from there.
And... Nope, 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 too much. There we go. What are you doing with me here? Oh, wrong button. I meant to hit that one. That doesn't work that way, Havoc. Come on. Oh, he just moved. Well, that's not nice. Well, gee golly. <laughs> All right, well, I guess we're going to wrap it up with that. Um, again, if you guys know why the things are being deleted, uh, please comment down below. Um, stay tuned. I guess we'll find out the results. Thanks for being here. Appreciate your guys' helps and comments that have brought us here. This is Havoc. Have fun and keep gaming.